Good morning, everyone. Happy Wednesday, I think. Oh, I'm going to sit down and have a quick cup of coffee before I have to get the boys ready. So, um, a busy day today. <laughs> uh, but before we, we get to that, hello, <laughs> hello from Henry. Um, I woke up about just after 6, six o'clock and I always check my um, video just to make sure that it went up and that you know we're way okay and I was like oh that's weird there's, there's no comments from it yet from it now I usually have like a few when I wake up well that's because I was so tired last night that it was set to go it was all set here's like you know who's here Lois um, but <laughs> Um, I forgot to set the time for it to upload. You can say good morning. She does have her breath fixed. That's why she's licking her lips. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. It was a good brekkie. <laughs> no spoof. <laughs> um, yeah, so I just. It was all set to go, set to upload. Just. Um, I didn't have the time. Yeah, I didn't have like that that button ready to go. I had it set to private instead of okay, upload at this time. Yeah, so it's happened before, and it it won't be the last time. <laughs> but I fix it right away. <laughs> so if you're wondering why it was late, that's why. <laughs> and if you've been watching for a while, you probably already knew that. So <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is what happens when you're tired. I went to bed nine thirty. I didn't even make their lunches, as you saw, I mean, I'm, I'm just made them right now. I said, I'm, I just said, okay, I'm going to make them in the morning, I'm going to bed, 9.30, I slept good, so, oh, sleep does you wonders, and today's going to be a busy day, like I said, because we are getting our fridge and we're getting a stove, um, so it's going to be a busy, busy day, so buckle up, okay, buckle up, buttercup. <laughs> I have a coffee right now, I'll probably have a couple of cups before... We go and we plus the first thing we gotta do is get our glasses. So that is first after we get the boys ready for school and they get dropped off. So um but I'm gonna have a quick cup of coffee first with Miss Miss Lois apparently. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And um yeah, we'll get going. Yeah, so um we're getting a new new stove from my godparents and they just got their stove I think the other day. But it been yesterday. Um, and we're also getting a fridge from, because they are redoing their kitchen, so that's why they're getting new appliances. And their stove is 13 years old. And that's old for a stove, but it does not look like it's 13 years old. It looks like it is, like, three years old. Um, because they had a cottage in PEI, and they recently just sold it, um, I think last year. I think it was last year they sold it, and they would they would make they would make the drive. It would take like two days to get there, but they would make the drive, and it just got to be too much to to do that. Um, so they sold it. It was just time time to sell, and um, so they've been going to PEI for well, for like I don't know, probably more than thirteen years. <laughs> so yeah, since I was in my twenties, because um, I was. I don't know how I, I think I was in my early twenties, um, because I I went with my mom and dad and we drove up with them. We were all packed in the car. Um, it was a fun trip. We were there for two weeks. It was a fun trip, and so they've had the cottage for a long, a long time, twenty, at least twenty, twenty years. So that stove um, would only get used when they were at home. They would be gone like at least maybe like four months out of the year in like the spring and summer and they would come back I think like in October so like that stove was sitting there not being used so it's like that's why it looks like it's brand new it only looks like it's like you know three years old maybe so and that'd be nice to have a new stove and have all four burners and I know we could have switched burners but it was just one of those things you know it's like yeah I think we got too used to it you know and 
It didn't seem to bother us that much. <laughs> it probably bothered a few of you guys when you saw it. <laughs> but like, why is there a bird or missing? But we just got a little bit too used to it. And it's like, oh, we know we can go buy it. And it's like, uh, I like we're getting a new fridge because a guy who is um, helping them redo the, their kitchen, I guess he had a fridge that was similar to their fridge. So it's like, okay, great, because our fridge is starting to go downhill. Um, there's water at the bottom, and it was never the greatest fridge. It never really was. Um, but we were in a pinch. We need it. Like when we when you when you first get married, you need everything. You need um, appliances. Like we didn't have any of that. We didn't have any furniture. You know, so we needed everything, and that's where most of our money went for a wedding that we got for gifts was like appliances and furniture, and then the the rest of it went towards our honeymoon. <laughs> Because I saved up quite a bit. <laughs> I saved up more than we needed to. And that we had um, a good chunk left over. And we used that for our honeymoon. Um, but it wasn't the best best French. So so what I have to do. I'll probably um, I'll do it. I have to empty everything. I'll probably do it. Because we're not doing it till like around 12 o'clock. The fridge and the stove. Um, and the guy. My, my godfather has like a guy that um, works for him now to help him out and the guy is going to help carry everything in so the hubby doesn't want to have to do anything because he shouldn't be lifting that much especially fridge and stove just because of his health um so that's great you know um but i have to empty everything out of the um stove and fridge and strip the fridge of all its artwork take the cereal off from the top uh, luckily there's not too much inside because it's Wednesday so I go shopping in a couple of days and everybody's fridge looks like that middle of the week there's like nothing nothing in there <laughs> no mm -mm. not much so that's good um, like it, it was working and we're, we were going to use it until it, it officially went kaput but yeah. this opportunity came I was like yep sure you know we'll take it yeah, uh, about 20 minutes you still got time finish your fruit loops Anyways, I'm gonna finish a cup of coffee and um, I'll check back in. Get these boys ready to go. I'm done. You're done? Okay. You ate all the Fruit Loops. Now you're full. Um, and yeah, we're gonna stay going. And um, yeah, I'll do that. Take everything out. I'm gonna be a little bit disorganized, but that's okay. <laughs> yeah, just for a little bit. Uh, but be nice. Yeah, have a new stove and fridge that doesn't leak water. So yeah, that will be nice. Yeah, it would always leak underneath, like the vegetable where you put the vegetable. You know, um, the doors. But we don't have the, we don't have the, <laughs> we we don't have the um, the drawers that you put like the vegetables and that in because those broke. So uh, I think a few years ago, you know. So um, I've been making do, and it has been frustrating. Yeah, but I just like you know, okay, whatever. You know, like just make do with the, what we have, and because that's where the water would leak. But then like our drawers where you would put so actually it was one drawer um where you would put the vegetables um that cracked and i was like yeah okay yeah, we need a new fridge it wasn't the best fridge but but at the time when you're in a pinch that's such a grab yeah anyways you're back the cat came back for more coffee <laughs> my, my kind of cat <laughs> So I just told Casey he has 20 minutes before he has to get ready for school, but I just looked at the time. Um, because I got up and down earlier, because I went to bed earlier, had a great night's sleep, which is great. It feels great. I feel good. Um, but then I looked at the time, I'm like, oh wait, no, you have like 40 minutes. <laughs> you get an extra 20, minutes. Yeah. You know, because I'm like, you know, because usually it's like by now, it's like, okay, yeah, you have 20 minutes, you have to get ready. But then it's like, oh wait, I got up early, so it's not that time, it's actually 7 a.m. You know, I'm here, I'm thinking it's like, you know, 7.20. <laughs> I'm waking up at 7 a.m. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh well. Extra time for him, and um, extra t extra cup of coffee for me soon. Yep. Excuse me, what are you doing? What a ride! Oh, that you, <laughs> Katie said she's going on a ride because she keeps doing that, going inside her dome. She she flipped it over quite a few times. Hello. Hello from Henry. <laughs> You're supposed to be settling down to go to sleep. Yeah. But is that party time? 
Yeah? Is there, a, is there a party going on? Party going on Yeah. Yeah? <coughs> yeah, you? Yeah. <laughs> and off we go to get our glasses. And it is freezing out here. Like, if anybody has, has seen spring, can you please send spring back? <laughs> because it's cool out here. This is like fall weather. Like, what is going on? with mother nature <laughs> please tell me because it's like it's cold yesterday was cold too all right so off we go and yeah we are in new glasses and um i cleaned off the fridge the top of it i took all the lovely artwork and anything that was on the fridge i put all that in the bag um i just had to do the oven take everything off and out of the oven and the food i'm going to leave that of course right until they come i'm not going to take it out and i guess they're coming around one o'clock so um right before they come once i get a heads up i will take out the food which isn't much <laughs> no <laughs> all right let's go get some glasses Ooh, and warm up Ooh. Ooh, who's that? A new pair of glasses. <laughs> I am not used to them. They are a little bit stronger. Um, so I will have to get used to them, but everything looks super clear. Um, we are all done. It took like 15 minutes. Not very long. So um, the bakery is just down the road. So we're going to cross the road and see what they have. Take a guy to there. Um, you can't really see that close right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here. Here. Come here. Yeah. Like, here's, here's a hubby. Here. Say I can see clear now. <laughs> I can't quite see one. So right here. Ah, uh, dun dun dun. It's close. Unless they sold out. Uh, we'll have to take you guys here another day. What? Come on. This is slow. Look, this is Wednesday. Oh, I think they're on vacation. That's why. Yeah, Wednesday, May 18th. Oh, wedding break. Okay, mm -hmm. good to know. Can't see, buddy. We will have to take you guys there another time. Now we're going to have to wait for big goods. Well, there's our bookstore, and right next to our bookstore is candy. No. <laughs> You'll never get me out of there if I go to a bookstore. <laughs> So right next to the bookstore is candy store. Hopefully opening soon. Right there. <laughs> I love candy. So we, we can go to the bakery, bookstore, <laughs> and candy. Yeah, that's a good lineup. <laughs> okay, now I have to get used to myself in these glasses. <laughs> All right, home we go. How are you doing? <laughs> it's gonna take me a couple of days to get used to the new frames, um, but yeah, I am liking them so far. And um, even she said that they they looked pretty. Um, yep. So and we didn't have to pay because when when we went to pick them up and we had our eye exam, she said that we would just have to pay forty dollars for the anti glare. Um, but we did not have to pay forty dollars. We only had to pay thirty three dollars and fifty cents each. So it came to sixty seven dollars even. So it's like okay, I like that, you know? Because like you go pay for them, you're like you're like okay, it's gonna be eighty dollars and there's no tax on that, and then the total was sixty seven. It's like what? Okay, yeah, I'll run, you know? Um, so we're not at home, I lied. We are at Tim Hortons to get my free coffee and the hubby went inside because um, the drive-through is way too long. It's almost up to the to the road. It's like, yeah, I can see the, I can see the cars only moving up. Um, this is the only Tim Hortons in town. We used to have two. This is the only one with a drive-through. The other one did not have a drive-through, and they they did not survive COVID because of lockdown. So they had to keep closing. So they did not survive. So we're down to one. <laughs> Tim Hortons and the lineup for the drive-through is always long, especially if you go here on a Saturday. Uh, but the hubby had to go to the bathroom, so he went inside to get coffee because he does the on the app, Tim Horton app, if you pick 
um, hockey players and they score, you can earn free coffee for a week. So it's like, yeah, okay, I'll take that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So he's going to do that and then we'll head home. I really was hoping the bakery was open. I thought it would be because it would have been nice to take you guys there, but I guess they're closed till May 18th for a wedding and he just forgot his wallet. <sighs> Yeah. That's one of the too. Can't take him out anywhere. No. No. <laughs> uh, um, uh, what was I saying? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, I forget. <laughs> oh, yeah, the bakery. Um, yeah, because um, when he said it was closed, I'm like, oh, are they, are they on vacation? Or maybe they sold out early because that has happened. They have, like, sold out really quick in the past and had to close early. Um, but no, they're closed for a wedding. So like, okay, so next month we'll take you guys there because we have gone stuff there and it's really good. We've gone bread, we've gone chocolate croissants, really good, super yummy when it comes from a bakery. So next month I guess we'll have to take you there. So that that was a bummer. Um but it, it but it was good that they are working on the candy store, so I'm excited for that. Yeah. <laughs> like, you know I'll be bookstore and candy store. No, I know. <laughs> uh I don't I don't I don't know if the bakery um has coffee, I'm not sure. Oh <laughs> if they do, we're in trouble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, but I love candy, and I see these candy stores on TikTok. There's one that is in Canada. Um, it's about two hours away from us. Um, <laughs> I wish they were closer. And last summer, I think that's when I started working on the building. Um, and I was so excited. I'm like, yes, yes, you know, Amherstburg is moving on up. We're finally getting a candy store. Because uh, we had a bookstore. I think our bookstore is like a couple years old. And then the bakery, I think, opened like a year ago almost. And so it's like, yes, you know, we're finally moving on up, <laughs> you know. And it's just nice to have these special stores to go to and not have to go too far. And especially candy, but that could be dangerous. I love candy. <laughs> candy and chocolates and if it's gummy oh count me in i love gummy candy yeah <laughs> it might be a dangerous store for me <laughs> but it'll be fun yeah oh let's wait for my coffee oh and i got i got an email from last night from um well they sent it last night i read it this morning um baseball it is on Remember I mentioned that um, they didn't have enough players. They want to have certain certain amount of players. I think like around 20-something. They only had 17, I believe. Um, so they want more players. Oh, here we go. I see a nice cat. Mm -hmm. oh. so they perfect, took, perfect. They took two things off. Okay. Oh, yummy. The, Free coffee. The, the rock. When I did it. Yeah. yeah. It's it only a wrap of showing. Oh, okay. So this is uh, the movie. Uh, nice. All right. The bra fix. No, um, that's lunch, by the way. Oh, okay. Bra fix last lunch. Brunch. <laughs> um, yeah, so baseball is on. Uh, I guess we'll be playing with, like, Harrow, Kingsville, towns around us. Not sure where we're playing yet. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to have to travel to those towns. So um, they're working on the scheduling part. <laughs> um, but yeah, so they, they are playing, so Henry will be very happy. We just have to find him a glove, and now we have to pay. <laughs> yeah, because I was like wondering why we didn't have to pay right away, because in the past years, as soon as you signed up, you had to pay. Um, but I think they did it this way just in case that way they wouldn't have to return your money because they had to do that last year, um, return everybody's money when they thought it was a go, but then it wasn't a go. So. All right, home for some brunch. What's going on, kitty? Mm -hmm. You curious? Yeah. <laughs> Out with the old. And in with the new. New to us. Mission accomplished. Look at that. Yay! 
You know you're you are an adult when like stuff like this makes you happy. Yeah. Um, so really happy that this is done. Check it off our list and um, new to us stove fridge. I'll turn the camera around and I'll show you. So first of all, look at that. There's a third. I mean third, a fourth burner. Fourth burner. I'm so used to three, so that's why I said third. Um, fourth burner. <laughs> and look at there's buttons to push. I love pushing buttons, and there's a clock on here. And look at that. Oh, I know yeah. <laughs> um, my godfather when we were outside, and he um took us out of the oven. <laughs> and I was like Oh, that might be a little tough to eat, you know, because you just take them out of the oven. And my dad, without missing a beat, said, yeah, just cook it at 400. <laughs> yeah, so that's awesome. Um, I do have to wipe the fridge really quick, um, but I just have to give a quick wipe down. So here is the freezer. That's not too, too bad. But look at cheese. Um, our old fridge did not have this. I think we did get ripped off. That's what happens when you buy cheap. But that was that's what was in our budget. So, and then look at vegetable crisper. Oh, vegetable! I have somewhere to put my vegetables. So as you can see, I do have to wipe it, and I'll clean it really good. And then I'll put everything back. I got stuff on the counter and stuff on the table and the pots and pans on the table and everything on top of the fridge is right here so um and i have to clean underneath the couch i might just do a quick vacuum before the boys come home um because they brought in the stove and fridge through the front door because we thought originally that the back door would be easier but i guess um this door right here it was too narrow so they had to take off the spring parts, that thingamabob, uh, out of, from the screen door. I don't know why you call it the springy, spring thingamabob, <laughs> you know? Um, so they had to take that, that part off. And we moved the couch, and uh, the hubby was like, oh, and the hubby was like, oh, it's like dirty, and it's like messy, and, and my godfather was, was in a, in the living room and I was like oh don't worry about it. you have kids I'm like yeah exactly when you have kids there are certain areas in your house that are dirty and underneath the couch is one of those areas and underneath the cushions <laughs> you know and my mudroom is messy because I haven't been able to get in there and clean it's been too stinking cold to clean and I don't feel like freezing my butt off and cleaning you know <laughs> well, I'm waiting for spring to return um but yeah you know that's that's okay um but the fridge our old fridge okay um was really really dirty because I didn't clean it because in my mind I was thinking knowing that we were getting getting a fridge I was thinking in my mind well this is going to the dump why do I have to clean it? You know, why am I wasting energy? Why do I have to clean it? You know, so so um. But I didn't think that in order for them to take the fridge out, that they would have to take the door off. So I'm outside. I'm like, <laughs> I can't explain. <laughs> you know? I know it doesn't matter, they're not gonna judge, you know, it, but it's like the, you know, it, it was just like the, the side, the door that was really, really dirty. Um, probably would need a knife to scrape off stuff. Um, <laughs> but it's like, in my mind, it was like, well, why, why should I clean this? You know, because we're getting a new fridge, you know, I usually do have a really clean fridge and so, um, but, um, I didn't want to waste energy, you know, I'm like, no, I'm not cleaning it, <laughs> you know, it's going to the dump, and it's just us that open a fridge, so, yeah, <laughs> but, you know, you can't help but feel a little bit embarrassed, even though it's like, okay, well, <laughs> it's our fridge, we're the ones that are looking at it, um, and I do keep clean appliances, but it's just that when you're getting another fridge, and that one's going to the dump, it's like, I'm not going to waste my energy, <laughs> you know, um, so it was my, it was my dad and my godfather, um, my dad's friend, um, a good family friend. Um, it was his trailer that they hitched up to his car 
to transport the appliances. And then um, my godfather and the guy that works for him, and also my godfather's son, who I guess just happened to stop by that day not knowing that this is what was going on. Um, so he pitched in <laughs> and helped. And so very thankful and grateful for all of the help and they um, were great. I had to, when they removed, when they removed the fridge, I had to, because our fridge um, leaked a water, I had to, um, when they were taken out, it leaked. There was a puddle, I had to wipe it. And I swept underneath there, I got all that. I didn't mop it, but I swept and um, got rid of all that yucky, you know, crumbs and who knows what else. So I did that really quick. And um, yeah, they got here around one third, 1.30? Yeah, around 1.30 and I say it took like about about an hour, you know, not too long. So yeah, now I'm just going to deal with this. Uh, but it just feels great to get that out of the way. We don't have to think about it, you know, and yeah, and then we have a peace of mind. We have a, a fridge that works a lot better than our old fridge and, and an oven, yeah. Um, I won't be used to opening the fridge and it's like, oh, there's a light. <laughs> we didn't have a light bulb in our fridge for a very long time because I kept forgetting to go get one. And I was like, well, why, buy, why buy one now? <laughs> you know, I'm getting under the fridge. So, yeah, <laughs> that's how I think. So, um, yeah, it all worked out. And um, I think that was that it. I think so. I think so. Oh yeah, and like I showed you Lois, she she was um yeah, she was being curious. She was like checking things out, you know, making sure, you know, that everything is okay, you know. Yeah, she was very curious, like what's going on? What are you doing? <laughs> Why is the couch over here? <laughs> yeah. Alright, so uh, I'm gonna do this and um check back in. Boys will be home soon. And yeah, I tell you the day went by super fast. Another thing I'm not going to be used to <laughs> is the handles <laughs> because our old one, he grabbed it from the side. <sighs> there we go. Abracadabra. Um, wiped it. The hubby helped clean it too. He finished it off for me. But there we go. I, I like that one better. You like this one better? Yeah. Yeah, you approve? Yeah. Uh, I, I like those. You like those? Yeah. And the yeah. cheese. <laughs> we gotta get used to this. This is high class, I tell ya. <laughs> we never add it No. So there we go. Looks pretty good. It will look even better once I go shopping on Friday. I still have to put the freezer stuff in the freezer because I took it out and put it in the big freezer. And I gotta put the cereals on top of the fridge. But I'm going to take a break because that was a lot of work. Cleaning it, wiping it, and then the boys came home. And, well, plus before that, I did underneath the couch, vacuumed it, cleaned it really quick. And then I started the fridge. And then they came home, and then the hubby took over, which was great and nice. And I put everything back where I like it. And now I'm going to sit down and take a break. Oh, and I almost forgot to tell you. I knew there was something else that I wanted to say when I was talking to you guys earlier. Um, because I had to take the door off of an old fridge and when my godfather was putting um, part of the, do the, the door, the, they, took out, they took off the door in the freezer part. So when he, when he was putting the door part um, in, the, in the trailer, because <laughs> it's just going to the dump, <laughs> um, there was baking powder on there and the baking powder <laughs> it spilled all over. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, my godfather was like, oh, con con contamination, call the, call the police. And I was like, oh man, that was the good stuff, you know. But it was, just, it was just baking soda. Baking soda. Did I say baking soda or did I say baking powder? I don't know. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm pooped. I'm going to sit down. But it was just funny. <laughs> I'm going to sit down and then I'll finish up. <laughs> <laughs> Are you soaking up the sun? Did you find a spot with the sun? Yeah? Oh, you're hot. Yeah, the black. Black likes the black. The black. <laughs> the sun likes the black and white pussycat. Yeah. Anyways, I'm going to say goodnight. 
in the vlog. It was a very busy day and got lots done, so felt great to get everything accomplished. I guess I gotta put my pots and pans away. <laughs> they're, they're right here. Oh, they're, they're fine right there. Yeah, they look, they look good. Oh, is Taco gonna say goodnight too? <laughs> okay. Say goodnight, Taco. Did he wake you up? Yeah, you look sleepy. You have sleepy eyes. Can we can we have a cat? <laughs> okay. You have a cat. Oh, a cat and a hamster. Did he wake you up? Yeah, I think he did. That guy was sleeping. I, was... I, 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 I can walk now. Okay, you can walk. She can walk. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. I really should really appreciate it. I'll see you in the next fun video. Take care, we bless, and TTFN. Talk to for now. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. Talk to for now. <laughs> I can walk. Okay, I okay. Walk. Okay, for now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye.